There is no place like home for the holidays, but what happens when your home is moved inside another home? Mm -hmm. A Lexington family recently found an unwanted Yuletide guest nestled in its Christmas tree. Here's a look at who was found. Who? <laughs> a decades-long tradition takes a turn. Every year. Love it. We pick it out as a family. When Santa showed up early to the White's house, but with the present the Lexington family did not expect. I was shocked. I, I was so stunned. <laughs> Rocking around their Christmas tree was an owl. The baby bird blending in with the branches, going undetected for four days. I have three dogs. We use this room nonstop, watch TV, kitchen's right here. No indication. <laughs> the first person to spot the feathered fellow was Bobby Hayes while the Whites weren't home. The owl was literally sitting on a lower limb here. Hayes and owns Magic Carpet Cleaning. After plugging in a piece of equipment, he noticed the tree sway and the owl on the prowl. It crawled up into the tree further and as it was in the tree further, it took me several minutes to even find it. Grabbing the bird in the nick of time, he sent this photo to Michelle. Thought he'd put a stuffed animal or an ornament in. I was like, so I called him immediately. I'm like, you're kidding me, right? And he was like, no. Michelle now telling Chris Kringle to put Hayes on the nice list. Because if she instead found the owl, she'd be hooting and hollering into the new year. I would have left the house. The, the owl could have stayed without me. I wasn't coming home. <laughs> Without injuring the baby bird, Hayes made the wise choice to release the owl in the family's backyard. Sure, it was pining for a wooded place once again. Uh, everybody's going to be able to have a Merry Christmas now. Michelle Nito points Christmas ornaments in her free time and is now inspired to stitch an owl one for the Christmas tree. She also told me that all of her friends, when they're searching for their Christmas trees now, they'll like <laughs> put their head in the tree and they'll snap pictures to her and being like, we're looking for owls, but we don't find one here. That was a great story and I love the line, the wise choice. Mm -hmm. I threw a lot of owl puns in there. It was well done. Very, very <laughs> enjoyable. Thank you, everybody. <laughs> I'm going to hear this the rest of the morning now. I am. You probably are. Thanks for the idea.